Oh, so 
I believe I'm one of his closest children, apart from his biological children. Baba Dechiron was a good man. Baba Dechiron had a heart for God. Things happen in life. We face challenges, we win some, we lose some. But Baba Dechiron was a good and honest man. He did all he could do in sincerity. Baba had a child's heart. He would not have something in his heart and say something else. Nobody is perfect. But Baba did, you know, was a good man. And I've always said there is no way I can tell the story of my life without Baba did, you know, taking many chapters. I met Baba Dechino when I was in my 20s. I met him on January 17, 1997. At CCC I was already a backup singer. I was in the world walking my journey. Then something led to something. I found myself in the Celestial Church of Christ. I actually came to Sele because I was attracted with the way my friends sang. So, I went to Akiode Parish. I was already something, at least, when I was in Akiode Parish, I was something. I was a member of the executives of the choir. I was the disciplinary officer or something. But why did they make me disciplinary officer? It means I'm not a very nice person. So one day, we did something in church. And they invited Lara, may God bless her soul, Lara or Resonia, and Shei So they came to do rehearsals with the choir. Why am I saying, am I saying this? I'm saying this because Baba did not fulfill purpose. Maybe from the little words of my story, something can change within you. And you will know that this life is nothing without you fulfilling purpose. It is not about how long you live. Baba did not live too long anyway. So Shei and Lara came, and they rehearsed with us, and they did, I think it was Ikore or something, and they did with us. So my friend Shola Anufora, I was asking her, I want people in Yembo not to walk. Because I had a heart for God. I've been singing. I wanted to sing for God. I wanted to be better. I could sing, but I wanted to be better. So I asked Shola where they came from, and Shola told me, ah, there's one Baba that trains them at Central Choir. That they did their rehearsals every Friday at Ovanikoro. I said, Ah, I'm a law. <laughs> so we went. I did not know that destiny was happening to me just because I just wanted to sing for God. I just wanted to use my voice. I didn't want to become anything. I just wanted to be better for God. <laughs> Kole dami le joi bi mote lo eh eh Kole romi le joi bi mori lo bi mo So I 
go to Obaniko. And want to cheer for Segbe. I'm sorry for taking your time, the organizers. I'm sorry. With all sense of humility, please forgive me. I need, I must do this. So, one call was back on our water They want to fetch audition for her. So the choir was on the other side. And they asked for Darotimi and Tayo, I think with George and somebody, to audition us. And so people were singing, people were. I was wearing my Keruba and Seraphon Sutana. I shall draw a man in Keruba and Seraphon. That was what I had that I was. I used to wear to Akiode. Come on, keep filming here, eh, Akiode. She won't film here, eh, Nisa Drogba. Because the Ashadura had puffs on the shoulders. So they were singing, and so I sang. It was my turn to sing, and I sang. <laughs> Gifts. 